All right, ladies and gents, got a 88 Bronco 2 here. Needs a radiator. Uh, as you can see, it's probably original. Got a little, I don't know, putty on it. And it's leaking down the side, whatever, you know, due to age and uh, got a few leaks, whatever. All right, so I'm just gonna walk you through this. First thing you wanna do, uh, set the radiator cap off. I've actually already gone and I'm losing everything. I figured I'd do a video while I was at it. Uh, so undo the cap. Um, you get down here to the bottom on this uh, passenger side of the radiator. It's going to be a plug like this. You uh, unscrew it. And I've already released the fluids, but the fluids are going to come out. Pull it out, let it drain out. Set it to the side. Here's the new radiator. Everything's plugged off. Good, good, good. Got my extra clamps here. Cool. Uh, next thing you want to do is get this fan shroud out. I watched a video on YouTube just for the fun of it, just to see if somebody would do something different, out of ordinary or whatever. And of course, I saw somebody they took the fans off. And I was like, there shouldn't be a reason to have to take the fans off just to get this radiator off. Well. Once you undo this screw in the clip to that top radiator, which looks like this, which I used the 516, which is probably the wrong size, but it was only ratchet that I had to fit a speed ratchet. But uh, undid that one. Fan trail should go straight back. Look at that. Got plenty of gap. Gonna undo this upper hose. Gonna undo that lower hose. And uh, got the two uh, screws here. And that is a. 1336. Yeah, bingo. So, and that should come right out. And then plug and play. Be right back with you guys. Alright, so, got the upper radiator mount undone. Cool. Got the top hose done. Cool. It was easy. The lower one's a little more tough. It's a bigger hose, so it's a little more tough. So, you always have to have a little persuasion tool around, which was a flathead. Boom. Just use the pride, boom, boom, you know, a little bit like that, so, and put a wiggle wiggle, and she should come right off, like that, cool, so, there goes that, alright, and like I said, you're gonna lose that fluid, so be sure to, uh, you know, replace that with uh, some new, fresh, uh, antifreeze, antifreeze, sorry. All right, well, that should come right out of it now. So let's get that fan trail back. And ta-da. Oop, there goes the donkey gun. All right. Now with the hold. And with the Stay tuned. So far, new radio is sliding in like butter. Got the upper mount screws going in like it's supposed to. Little hose going on. Uh, let me get this one in place first. Okay, yeah, the clamps are gonna be right there. And we got that, that hose like so. Look at that. Be right back with that funnel. Put you on that. All right, guys. All right, ladies and gents, like I said, upper mounts are tightened down. Boom, boom. Cap is on. Fan shroud is fastened. Upper hose is tightened. Lower hose is tightened. Now, don't forget, time to fill it up with some fluids, guys. Fluids. You lost a lot of fluids. If I can get this thing off, here we go. And that'll be the end of that one, guys. Stay tuned for the next videos on the 88 Bronco.